Good morning children and hello parents. Welcome to standard 3 EVS class. Today we will revise two chapters, chapter 11 and chapter 12. Let's start with chapter 11, cooking and eating. Let's go for the first question. Choose the right word from the bracket. Here two words are given, you have to choose the right answer. Idlis, samosas are cooked by steaming. Idlis are cooked by steaming, so you put a tick mark here. Number B, fuel used in angiti. Sun's energy, coal. What do we use in angiti? We use coal. Question number two, fill in the blanks. Number A, the method of frying in which least oil is used is, it is stir frying. Number B. Cakes and biscuits are cooked by. Cakes and biscuits are baked. So your answer is baking. Number 3. Write true or false. Number A. Food cooks fast in a pressure cooker. This statement is right. So you write true here. Number B. We should eat junk food on a regular basis. It is not right to eat junk food on a regular basis. So your answer is false. Number four, answer these questions. Number A, why do we need to cook food? We need to cook food to make it Soft, tasty and easy to digest. So, we need to cook food to make it soft, tasty and easy to digest. Number B. Why is it a good practice to eat together as a family? Eating together gives a feeling of togetherness. And it is a time for sharing. So children, your answer is eating together gives a feeling of togetherness and it is a time for sharing. Question number 5. Give two examples of each. Number A. Junk food. Name any two junk food. You can write noodles and chips. Next. Number B. Different fuel used for cooking lpg and coal chapter 12 where do we live question number one fill in the blanks number a dash houses are usually found in places where it rains heavily in places where it rains heavily you find stilt houses number b and das is a dome shaped house made of blocks of ice and igloo is made of blocks of ice question number two give one word answer number a a house made of canvas that can be fixed and folded easily it's tent number b Colourful designs made at the entrance of the house. It is Rangoli. Question number 3. Choose the right answer. Here in bracket two words are given. You have to choose the right answer. Number A. Houseboats are seen in. B. 
Bihar, Kashmir. Where do you find houseboats? You find houseboats in Kashmir. Number B. Garbage should be thrown in. Dustbins, roadside. We should use dustbins to throw garbage. Question number four. Unscramble to get the right answer. Number A. A house on wheels. When you unscramble this, your answer is caravan. Question number B. Sunlight kills. Sunlight kills germs. Question number 5. Answer these questions. Number A. On what factors does the type of house a person lives in depend on? The type of house a person lives in depend on requirement of the family, the income of a person and the raw materials available in that place. Question number B. Differentiate between temporary and permanent houses. Temporary houses are not that strong. They get damaged by rain and storm. Whereas permanent houses are strong and last for many years. Now let's move on to the next topic that is match the followings. Number one, igloo. Igloo is found in Greenland. So you write one here. Number two, puris. Puris are deep fried. You write two. Number three, chulhas. What fuel is used here? We use wood. So you will write three here. Number four, microwave. Microwave uses electric current. Number five, floor art in Bengal. Floor art in Bengal is called alpana. Write number 5 here and stilt houses are found in Assam. So you write 6 here. Next, draw and color. Here some drawings are given here. You have to practice these drawings. A houseboat, a rangoli design. Parents, worksheets related to these topics will be uploaded on the school website. Kindly go through them and help your child to do them. Thank you.